I really am curious every morning to see what might be new scientifically. I'm Matthias von Heroth. I was born in Germany in 1963, and I practiced medicine in Germany, and then came to the United States in 1991, and have ever since been in type one diabetes research with a passion to really find a cure and solution for patients. I felt that for type one diabetes, there was one of the biggest needs and also the biggest opportunity to really make a difference for the patients who have the disease. I'm very family oriented. That means a lot to me. I have some hobbies. <laughs> I do sports. I love to ride a bicycle and I love music. I play a lot of violin. I love to intersperse also professional events with music. It, it's important for, for my soul and equilibration. There's a general mindset in the DRI and in the university of collaboration and collaborative spirit. So I came and I thought, oh, I really got to come. This is much better than anything I have ever seen in research. I feel the big problems that we are facing also for type 1 diabetes they cannot be addressed in silos, in solitude. So it's the collaborative mindset is pervasive. You have ever so often really a breakthrough, a major milestone of having things come a bit closer to being able to make a complete cure for a disease. And that's really driving me. I'm most excited about the science advances. The trials from Vertex have shown that stem cell derived islets can work eminently in patients. We have had prevention bios drug that's now licensed to Sanofi, can prevent diabetes altogether maybe two and two, two and a half years in patients at risk. This is a tremendous breakthrough. It gives everybody hope because it's one big building block we need to eventually envision how a cure could come together. It's a tremendous honor to be a part of it. <laughs> it's humbling and it's a huge honor uh, to, to take on this position in the DRI for me. I feel I'm standing on the shoulders of giants who built really something super special. The border is pretty tall, what we need to achieve. I think that's the key role of an academic institute disease focus like the DI, to fill this gap and then function as a key accelerator. We want to be a key accelerator. We want to be known for that we hopefully enable things that might have taken 30 years, only take three years. That's the wish, because time matters. So we need to find a solution, something that's less invasive and better tolerable and makes life easier for everybody.